Assalamu alaikum. Welcome back to another tutorial. In this tutorial, uh, we will work on the Niagara system footsteps. As you can see in the video, that whenever a character feet touching the ground, uh, the dust particles are spawning. Actually, these are the Niagara system. So you can also get the project files on my Patreon. Let's jump into the tutorial. Let's start our tutorial. First of all, uh, you can notice that the the character has footstep sounds and the random sound is playing. Actually, it's only a one sound, uh, but I have made its pitch random. So, and I have used meta sounds on it. You can watch the previous tutorial. Uh, the link is in the description and also you can see it pop up here. So, for this tutorial, we are going to use Niagara system for footsteps. And so first of all, uh, we have to create a Niagara system, but I have already created a Niagara system. I'm not a VFX artist, uh, artist so definitely I am uh, not much into the uh, Niagara system. But uh, to just to show you the basic uh, how the Niagara system works, uh, I will show you. Uh, you can, after selecting the Niagara system, go to next and select the empty one, click here and finish and rename it to foot tab 2 we will uh, use our previously created niagara system but just for the tutorial uh, let's uh, create a simple niagara system for that uh, go to emitter update and write pawn rate select that or select that any now in there, uh, select and any give any value which uh, whichever you want. So after that, in this particular update, add velocity. Okay, add velocity here in the particle spawn. Add velocity. Now after that, click here that one, the second one. And uh, we are, uh, that's the uh, x-axis. And but we want to move our particle on the y-axis. So give the value of 50. And give here the value of 10. And you can also give a random value by right here, random range vector. And you can give any value like minus five, to 5 on x-axis and 50 on there and something like um, minus 10 no uh, not uh, 0 mm, let's give 5 to 15 so it will be look like that so for the first step we need to make uh, go to there uh, in the system update system state and loop behavior once and loop duration to only one second will be enough for us and scroll it back to uh, for our easiness so now after that in here go to initialize particle here initialize particle and select lifetime instead of giving it a constant value give it a random value between um, 0 to 0.3 to 1 maybe and also And also, uh, you can increase the size from here. Uh, let's give it a size of... You can also choose a random or uniform. Any value you can choose. Let's give it a value of 25. And after that, I think... Now, in the particle update, add color simple color and give it a 
as something like brownish now inside the editor if we drag particle he can okay let's bring it uh, that one now you can see it it is running only for one second now our Niagara system is ready now we have to use it on the footsteps now if you notice that our character has running animation so we are going to add Niagara system in running animation so let's save it so this is the one which we have created just now and this was the original Niagara system and now we will use this one which we have just created so that's the third person character and these are the animations and anim blueprint and blend space link with that third person character and I will upload all the project files to Patreon and you can get from my Patreon so in the running animation as you can see and the meta sound is already there added so we have to add a Niagara system here move it here the right and the point at which our feet touches the ground right click here add notify and play Niagara particle effect and select what we have just created that one the two one and simply copy it and okay there is the one problem you will notice that it is moving in the forward direction it means we have to give velocity here in the mm, opposite direction okay now uh, yes it's working now so now copy it and go to the point where our right foot touches the ground and simply Control V, paste it. Now again, on the left foot, when touches, and do it for every time. And right now, if we run it, now the our particle system are ready. Now let's. Now you can see, our character has and kind of dust particle attached to our footsteps. So in the next tutorial, what we will do is we will attach uh, the dust particle with the right feet aligned to right feet and the left feet. So that's it for this tutorial and you can get all the project files on my Patreon. So till next tutorial, Allah Hafiz.